Konnichiwa minna. Hello everybody! In this video, I want to talk about Pokemon TCG Pocket. This will not be a One Piece video. So if you guys would like to see more of these types of videos from me, definitely subscribe down below. So let's get started. So to start off with, I am really really excited for Pokemon TCG Pocket. I love how it is a simplified version of how to play the Pokemon trading card game. It is kind of like Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links or Speed Duels. And they also did take a little bit from Pokemon My First Battle, if you guys remember that. Um, which is really, really cool to see because I do love Duel Links, I do love um, Speed Duels. And yeah, the Pokemon trading card game has definitely gotten complicated over the past couple years and power creep and more expensive and things like that. So it looks like they are cutting everything in half, just like Duel Links or Speed Duels. So instead of five Pokemon on the bench, there's three Pokemon. And I'm guessing that like instead of 60 card decks, it's going to be 30 card decks. Instead of a seven card hand, there's going to be a three to four card hand. Um, like instead of six prize cards, it's going to be three. And, if, and instead of prize cards, there's going to be the prize coins. So we don't have to worry about screwing ourselves when it comes to prize cards or, um, or improving ourselves by drawing a prize card, um, whatever situation that is. So we don't have to worry about the gamble of prize cards harming us or helping us, which is cool. Um, like I said before, the artwork looks amazing. I love how um, they took some of the old artwork from like base set, Jungle, Fossil, even Majestic Dawn. And also, they also did a couple of new artwork as well, as we see with the Gardevoir, the Articuno, um, such things like that. And I do love um, like the cards where you can go inside the background, which is also really, really awesome. Yeah, the artwork just looks amazing, and it definitely looks 10 times better than PTCG Live, which is why I'm throwing that app in the trash. I don't like PTCG Live. I prefer PTCGO. PTCGO was so much better, but that's a whole separate video for a different day. So, yeah, really, really excited for the app. Cannot wait to play it. And then I also want to give, I guess, my ideas of what I want to see in Pokemon TCG Pocket. Like, it's basically just taken from Duel Links. So this is not my idea. This is just, yeah, like I said before, I'm taken from Duel Links. So what I would like to see is that I would love to see a physical version of Pokemon TCG Pocket. They could create boxes like this, like they do in Speed Duels. Like, they can make, like, Pokemon TCG Pocket boxes like this. And we can just have all the different character decks, like... Um, what's cool about Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links and Speed Duels is that it like appeals to people that are a fan of the Yu-Gi-Oh! anime. And, you know, because we all know that Yu-Gi-Oh! is all about nostalgia and Pokemon is also about nostalgia. There's a lot of people that are a huge fan of the old school anime. So I think they should put, put that into Pokemon TCG Pocket. Like, um, we can have, like, different character decks, like, maybe one for Ash, maybe one for Misty, maybe one for Brock, like the gym leaders, like Lieutenant Surge, um, Sabrina, uh, Blaine, or Koga, um, you know, um, the, like, like, such things like that. I think that would be really, really cool. And maybe they can create skill cards of the characters from the anime. Um, and they all do do different things. Like maybe they can create some Ash skills, Misty skills, Brock, like the gym leaders, the Elite Four. Um, I, I, I think that would be awesome. Like maybe they can create like an Ash skill card. Um, like may, maybe like the different Pokemon versions of skill cards. They can make some of them act like stadium cards. Some can act like trainer cards, supporter cards, item cards. Um, yeah, like same, same thing with um, Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links. Maybe they can create like an Ash skill, um, like with a stadium card that's like um, Pallet Town, like Misty with Cerulean City Gym, um, Brock with Pewter City Gym. Um, like they can make some skill cards um, act like items and supporters, like, like I said before. Maybe they can create a skill card um, that allows you to mulligan once per game because I think it really sucks 
that Pokemon um, does not have a mulligan system. Like, I think all the, the, the Bandai um, TCGs have a mulligan system. I think Carfight Vanguard has a mulligan system. I think even Magic has one, too. So why is it that Pokemon and Yu-Gi-Oh! Like, is the only two card games that I can think of that don't have a mulligan system? I think we should have a mulligan system in Pokemon. Like, if you don't like your hand, you could shuffle it back in, draw a new hand. You could do that once per game. Um, like, I think they can create a skill card like that where you can do it. Um, that would definitely be a perfect opportunity for it. Um, so, yeah, that's just my idea. Um, I think that that would be really, really cool if they can create a physical version of Pokemon TCG Pocket. They can make boxes like this twice a year like they do with speed duels, and maybe they could do like some side events uh, with Pokemon TCG Pocket. I think that'll be awesome. So, yeah guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please leave a comment, like, and subscribe, and let me know what you guys think about this video down below. And also, what are you guys' opinions about Pokemon TCG Pocket? Are you excited for it? Do you like it? Do you also want to see a physical version? of Pokemon TCG Pocket. I would love to know. So yeah guys, I will see y'all next time. Matane!